guys, Sheldon Allen here with Crush TV. We're here at the third annual Tattoos by the Bay convention and we're going to go talk to some tattoo artists, some other people hosting and um, see what's going on. TV. I'm hanging out with Pimpin and Big Man. We're here at the Tattoo uh, convention. Expo, Expo convention. convention. The Tattoo, whatchamacallit. Now, uh, you've been hosting, right? How's that been going? I love it. You love it? Coming back to Corpus, we did the show the last two years, and it's been great. Uh, I'm really looking forward to coming back this year because we moved it over here, and it's worked out for us. Were time. you here yesterday? Were you hosting the Midget? Wrestling? Yes, yes, yes. Because I'm pretty sure I was here when a midget drank something really gross. Yeah. I don't know if I should even say. Can I say that? Urine. He drank his. Yeah, thank you, big man. He drank his own you. urine. And not only that, he peed on my hand while he was doing it. <laughs> he would do what? He peed on my hand. I was holding the. And then didn't some girl make out with him for a t-shirt? Yes, she did. For a Only in corpus. Only in yeah, corpus. we're some classy broads, right? It's, it's midgets. I mean, they have this magnetism about them. The half line brawlers are pretty magnetic. They get chicks to drink their urine everywhere. I'm so grossed out right now. And you are the main sponsor of this whole event, right? One of them. One of the main sponsors? And what is your... Uh, I have a tattoo shop on Everhart called Fat Tats. Fat Tats? How long has that been? Five years. Five years? Awesome. And uh, how do you guys get all these people from different places to meet up in one spot? Because we travel all over the all over the place with this guy. Oh, okay. I got you. So it's a camaraderie. Yeah, he does a lot more shows than I do, but I mean, I do like seven or eight a year, so he probably does like one or two, sometimes three a month. Yeah, and... In 42 years. 42. So you can only watch so many midgets pee. Okay? Actually, I'm, I'm hosting the Half-Line Brawlers this year. Are you? I guess that doesn't really get old though. Oh, they're midgets. Yeah. And so they also did the suspension thing as well. They're working and they're, on one right now. They're working on it right now. I saw that. That looks like a curse. Yeah, it's going to be crazy today. 50 points. 50 needles. Yeah, that never okay. happens. Is that the same guy who did it yesterday? No, no, no. It's a different guy today. Okay, I was going to say you might get a little weak. <laughs> That's something you would think. These guys hang three or four times a week. Really? Yes. To do that. I love it. That's what they're here for. I mean, Some of the guys, it's therapeutic to them. If they couldn't suspend, then they'd probably be messed up. Well, hey, Some of them it keeps whatever them out of flips your skirt <laughs> or hangs They're avoiding prison sentences, and this keeps them off the bottom. Whatever works. Definitely. So, uh, how much longer is this going to be going on? Is this the last day? Or? My mom watch will be here until 8 o'clock tonight. Okay. And how many days was this? It's a three-day event, uh, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. All right, and when are you guys going to be coming back? Next year. Same time, same place? Somewhere around the same time, maybe not the same place. <laughs> I heard uh, hopefully your guys will be getting a little bit bigger venue. Yeah. I don't want to say where, because... Yeah, if, if everything secret. works out, it's going to be really awesome. Cool. All right, well, you guys, if you missed it this year, you suck, first of all. Second of all, make it next year. You don't want to miss it. There's all kinds of fun suspension, tattoos, midgets. So uh, come see these guys, and I'll be here as well. Hey, guys. Crush TV. We're hanging out with Susie and Snapper. Uh, Susie is one of the organizers here for the, the tattoo convention. Um, how do you organize all this together? It's a lot of legwork. We organize it. It takes about a year to get it going on. Our third year going, and hopefully it'll be 20 more years of it. Nice. Um, as far as the years in the past, how was the turnout this year compared? To this year was very good turnout. The biggest draw was we had the midget wrestlers last night. Um, today we've got the 50 point suspension going on in the parking lot. Right. Um, he's oh, they're going to hang him in the parking lot. Yes. Out Not back in here. where the bike bike show is. Oh, they wow. didn't have rafters high enough in here, so they had to take it outside. Um, he's doing a 50 point uh, crucifix suspension because he just turned 50 years of age. Uh -huh. So he wanted to do this suspension and in honor of his forefathers. Right. Um, I heard that that's never been done before. Never. 50, you know, 50 hooks through his body. Right. It's never been done before. So the first time it's being done is here today in Corpus. Yes. That's pretty cool. So, um, what should we be looking forward to next year? What do you got organized for us? I have 
it's going to be a secret until next year. We're going to, it's going to be a whole lot better. And every year it's going to expand and get bigger and better each year. Um, everything from the Crush Girls to anybody and everybody that wants to be involved. The more people involved, the better we like it. Well, thank you so much. And what are you getting done today? I'm getting a mom tattoo. Oh, no, we're doing a mom tattoo. She was 40. In this picture, she was 45, same as job was when she passed away. You, you guys kind of look a lot alike. Yeah, everybody tells me I look like dad, but I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, Snapper, do your best work today. You don't mind. Well, I try to do my best work every time I tattoo somebody. Alright. Well, I've been doing it a long time, so I, uh, I kind of got it figured out. Oh, yeah. How long have you been tattooing? 38 years. 38 years. <laughs> well, you guys have fun, and I hope it comes out well. Guys, we're here hanging out with uh, Jeremy at, with, from Custom Ink Tattoo. What do we got going on right now? We got a talk that we're going to enter an award uh, here at Tattoos by the Bay. Uh huh. Try to take that award today with this piece. I'm pretty far behind on it, so I got a lot of work to do before we enter it. The award's at six o'clock, and hopefully they'll look at it seriously. Right. Familiar to me, or it's a Frankenstein kind of Frankenstein poem on top of a hill. This okay. is a Frankenstein theme, uh -huh. and uh, <laughs> we've come in with a lot of, you know, all the way from the house to the. Uh, we got some haunting. Oh, yeah. I got some skies that are, some stars that I still need to drop in. Some some take it easy slow. Got some graveyard. We got bats. We got a portrait on the back. So, this piece has got a lot of detail in it, and detail is where your work's at. It's real clean, real blended, real well. That's what we're about here at Custom Inc. And when do you have to have this in by, you said? Uh, six, six o'clock, I will be totally done. And done. Really? Yeah. How long does a piece like this usually take? Um, we've probably got about uh, 30 hours wrapped up in this piece. I use the pneumatic system, which is the air-driven tattoo machine, as you can see here. Yeah. I don't use foil machines or anything like that. It's a real soft hit. It's less of a painful tattoo. So it's real important that my people get less pain so that I can tattoo on them longer. Yeah, I've heard you know a couple of com people complain of certain tattoos having a heavy hand. Yeah, you can you can have the the heavy-handed artist or the uh, you know if the artist is really trained correctly, he'll float his needles is what we like to call it. Um, that's just doing a surface, you know, I don't have to really drill it all the way to your soul. I'm not after <laughs> doing that. Um, I just want to get a good image on the top layer. And uh, our, ours heal up in about three days using the pneumatic system. Right. Um, and that's because we, we work our needle on top of our surfaces. Um, I think the industry is really coming to that. It's coming to a coil, a coil machine is being evaporated and we're really going to a lot hitting, a lot, a lot of machines that hit a lot lighter, just like this. I love it. You love it? Yeah, it's a bit painful, but I don't know, it's pretty You better good. say that. I'm in control. <laughs> <laughs> right? You better say it's coming out good. You want to find my soul? Well, he found it, and he's standing in my soul right now. <laughs> he's inside your soul right now? Yeah, he yeah. is. Kind of funny. Right. Well, the skeleton's in the closet here. <laughs> so where is uh, Custom Ink Tattoos located? We're located out in Fort Aransas, Texas. It's the back door to Bernie's, which actually I call it the front door, but everybody else calls it the back door. <laughs> But uh, right there on Tarpon Street at 722 Tarpon, Fort Aransas, Texas. And you can also check us out at custominktattoo.com. Awesome. All right. Well, thank you and uh, good luck. And I wish you the best. In oh, work. I appreciate it. Thank you. All right. See you guys. Hey guys, Crush TV. I'm here with the Corpus Christi Maidens. Mm -hmm. Say hello, Woo! ladies. Yeah. And Sparkling City Roller Doll. And the Sparkling City Roller Doll. We can't forget about her. <laughs> and, um,. We were here, I mean, have y'all been here all three days at the tattoo yes. convention? Yes. Yeah? And so you've seen some pretty cool stuff, right? Awesome stuff, yeah. yes. What was one of your favorite things? Uh, we were let, Well, they're doing the suspension show, and the first day, it was awesome. Well, it was kind of gross, but awesome. But <laughs> the guy put his, like, pitch hook in, and it was so heavy that it, like, pulled it way out, and it, like, 
out of his skin. Out, pulled what way out? The, his leg, the, the, the push up. The piercing went through, yeah, went through his, his skin and just pulled right out. So all you saw was blood and guts. <laughs> so it was awesome. Yeah, everybody cheer. It there. was awesome. Yeah, there the was like mouth drops. It was like, oh. Like, so. <laughs> they stapled balloons to his forehead. Yeah. Oh my God. They had a staple gun. They were stapling money. He yeah. was stapling everything to any place you wanted it to be. staples? Yeah, there was yeah. a good time. Yeah, I saw that. They were yeah. cool. Yeah, they yeah. did some weird stuff. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, I know. Um, and they were so, cute. They were the perfect yeah. size. Yeah. <laughs> did you guys help out this year or anything? What yes. did you? Yes. What, how did you guys, or how we, were y'all involved? I'm sorry. We were mainly like traffic control, make sure that the people came in with Not their bracelets. Take them out. Yeah. Right? yeah. <laughs> yeah. Give a couple of hip checks. Just a couple. Be like, that girl doesn't have a wristband. Yeah. A nice. little bit of security, but mainly eye candy. Yeah. <laughs> and so when can we see you guys next? May 27th. It's at the Ayers Event Center, uh, 3433 Ayers. Uh, right across. It starts at 7, but the doors open at 6.30. All right, and need who, who to are you going to be uh, beaten up? Well, it's a tribute to our military. It's Navy versus Army, so the military men and women will get discounts at the door. Okay. Yeah. It'll be an interleague bout. It's real fun. Okay, yes, really lots cool. of fun. Yeah. And how long have all y'all been doing this? I kind of just started. You just, yeah. yeah. You just started I just like recently this started. Month yeah. Or, uh, it's been like two months or a month now. About two months. Okay. Yeah. How long have you been doing? About four years now. Four years. Yeah. Since 2005. It's 2005. <laughs> Three years. Three years? Oh. Since March. Okay. About a year. About a year. And she's been going two years. Yeah, I was going to ask you when did the <laughs> Junior League start. Yeah. And when can we see a Junior League? The next game is the 27th. The 27th, right? 27th, and then uh, in June, and then we're also playing um, um, Ann Richards, which is a team in Austin. So we're going to be going up to Austin. Oh, that's cool. Very so they're cool. going to be going up to Austin on the 28th. So we have games back to back. All right. The games will be on the 22nd in, against uh, San Antonio. So right. 22nd there, the 27th here. All right. Well, ladies, thank you for talking. Thank you for well, helping you. out for the convention. Yeah. And uh, have fun. And yeah. we're going to watch the suspension. So. All right. And cheer for me for Mrs. Tattoo by the Bay. All right. <laughs> Let's check it out. Why should we vote for you? Let's see how those tats go. All right, because she can shake them. Show them your assets. Let me see. Hold on. The ladies. The ladies. No, man, and t you have 50 hooks in your body right yes. now, right? Yes. And that is in tribute to your 50th birthday, I heard? Yes, yes, yeah. yeah. Do you want to tell me a little bit about how long you've been doing this? I've been suspending for about 14 years, uh -huh. roughly, and uh, this has been something that I've always wanted to do all my life. Yeah. And um, it's 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 um, it's a part of me of my life that came to fruition once I left corporate life. I got yeah. you. I got you. That's 26 great. years of corporate life, and now I'm living my life like I need to be. Well, this is good. What I need to do. Good. What was um that smoke stuff they were doing? That was sage. I smelt it and it smelled yeah. good. I was, it was like sage. Sage is used for for the purification and the blessing of the surroundings and the people and the objects and the everything. Just to you know, because um, this is a this is a, a, a sacred journey. Right. Yes. Right. It's, uh, and a lot of people will do these things to rage and just to have fun. And oh yeah. My 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 mind is uh, my spirit is just more. Yeah, you know, that's nice to see that side of it too. You know, because watching, we're like, oh my gosh, she's that guy has all these hooks in him. You know, he's gnarly, but you know, talking to you, you're just so calm and awesome. You're like, I just want to be up there. You know, I love it. I love your attitude. And um, this is the first time it's ever been done too, right? Well, maybe here. No, it's been done before. In fact, it was just done last night in Moscow. Oh, yeah, they had friends, to do yeah. that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it's, it's been. Really I think it's been done. Uh, Seventy-five hooks have been done before, okay. and uh, this is my first time uh, at, a, at a major uh, number of hooks. So right. the next step would be would be oh, seventy-five sure. or hundred. Really, yeah. really. And when would you be planning on doing that? Probably towards the end of this year. Yeah. 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 Cool. Well, how are we going to find out if you do it? Look me up at modworld.org. <laughs> awesome. All right. Mod well, thank org. you for talking to me. And, My pleasure. Uh, good luck up there. I'm scared thank for you. you. <laughs> thanks, thanks for being here. Thanks for your yeah, time. I absolutely. appreciate it. Absolutely. Yeah. Hey, guys. That's it for this uh, webisode of Crush TV. Um, we're here at the third annual tattoo convention. It was awesome. Everything from midgets to suspensions and, of course, tattoos. That's the obvious. Um, but they are doing it next year. It's a secret spot right Right now we don't know where it's gonna be. But we'll find out and come out and support us. See ya.